is the car. It is the call, your number one album breaking uh, show, and definitely I'm gonna be your, your comedian for today. Trust me. <laughs> and um, that will last for long. It will last for long. Mm. Are you sure? Okay. Why? Why do you we think finish, we finish? We better better it. Yes, let's try. Yeah, no, let's just bear enough. with our. Let's bear with this. Okay. Yeah, trust me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it is the call, your number one album breakfast show, and you know what we do? We are not streamlined. We are not the normal. We are not the ordinary. And I got the beautiful, extraordinary Faye right yes, here. Yes, no, really. S A Y, like y'all know. I no, see no. right hand man, like I always call you D A K E F. Jacket D K. I thought you were international standard. Yeah, I am. But sometimes you just have to come local now. You know how we do it. International local. Okay. <laughs> like that. That's like international though. Like, like, oh, <laughs> you're pressing me. Don't, don't try to make it feel fly. <laughs> All right, guys. In case you're just joining us, it's a call your number one album break the show. And you know what we do. We talk about tropical issues making rounds all across the universe. Yep, yep. Just the Earth. We, talk, we go from, you know, the Earth to Mars Planet, to Jupiter, so on, whatever, so man. You know, and we, we talk about... Really because you can go there, <laughs> Shibi. It's okay. <laughs> really interesting topics that you guys want to listen to, that you guys crave to have answers to. And apart from that, we also have... Um, Different segments on the call. We have yeah. the street talk segment. We have the magnet. We have the cookie jar. We have the now and then. Yep. And, you know, so many other things. I mean, just expect the, the trills so and the turns. Packages. And then our guest also to enlighten us on whatever we're talking about. Say, hey, definitely, how would you definitely. go on to miss this? The yeah, perfect massive, way to kickstart your massive day. Massive guest, definitely. How are you doing, Faye? What's going on? I'm good. You're I'm great. great? Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. I like, I like you like but you know it's not really you hardly see a lady you not know, rocking earrings and still look fly ah so you have to, have to, no, no, no. I have to give you that for that that's, that's you, you keep thinking i'm gonna anyway so we're going to short break and when we return the paper talk segment comes through keep it locked on the court this is the car all right, we yep, get yep. to you know read the news for you know important headline news. Basically. Yeah, front for pages. Everybody. Yeah, front pages, and I'll be taking from the Punch newspaper this morning. All right, so CBN says banks becoming less resilient, retain key rates. Aladdin retires as Apex Bank deputy governor today. Forbes billionaires list Dangote Adenuga's net worth drops by seven point four billion dollars. Wow. Tedola Rab Rabiu out. Believe that ARG others group berate police for one sided arrests. Abu to speak on Malaye today as Senate begins probe. And lawmakers investigate alleged Sarakis 298 millionaire Ahmad Jeep. And Zaki Biem, death toll hits 52 and Buari orders probe. Again, South Africans attack five Nigerians. Confusion as doctor's family rejects corpse. Now, that's about the suicide um, story that happened over the week in um, Lagos, Nigeria, third million bridge. That's all I have in the Punch newspaper headlines. All right, guys, so on to the Daily Sun, the front page of the Daily Sun newspaper. We have xenophobia again. Mm -hmm. Five Nigerians attacked in South Africa. Dangote Adenuga, Alakija, dropping Forbes billionaire rating. Mm -hmm. And um, trouble in Senate. Indume faces suspension. Saraki Melaye under investigation for over imported SUV certificate. Mm. Lagos Lagoon suicide. Anxiety over doctors' cops. Search continues. Nobody will be allowed to disrupt Bernie Jetty. And that's by Wiki. Okay. Ali at Asurok to shun Senate. AGF writes senators as lawyer goes to court. And Amber Central will field candidate win election APC and that's yeah. what we have on the front page of the Daily Sun newspaper all right for the sport lovers in the world I'm just gonna go through the headlines make your rounds in the world of sport today all right this is um some really really wishful thinking from Arsenal so he says uh, we can eliminate Man City Fabio says that and the broad comes with a comeback and says it will be very tough trying to make Arsenal feel happy it's all good Torres returns and have it out and also we have Cotua Hazard could leave for Real Madrid. I don't see that happening though. I'm a Chelsea person, so I really don't see that happening so for a couple of years. <laughs> Old lady broke um, last eight spot. And also we have um, Messi Suarez admits to pain sitting down. That is really, really um, displeasing to hear and to imagine. All right. And we have um, Champions, Champs, Champions League, Champions League uh, football made Lukaku rejects contract and the area from uh, area from manchester united banned for two games 
Uh, here Nacho Gs up for Monaco Clash, trains with the City Stars, and we have um, Pinnick arrives in Addis Ababa, exuding confidence. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, we have um, Moses Simon, I'm back to my best. And that's all I have on the sport, um, sports he headlines this morning. And on to entertainment news, we have Congrat, former BB Niger housemate, thin, tall Tony and wife, reportedly expecting baby number three. Wow. And legendary singer Shade attends Drake's concert and the internet is freaking out. Apple set to release new iPhone 7 and 7 Plus color this March with proceeds to go to global funds, HIV and AIDS programs. Lagos government bans live music, live band music in bars and restaurants. Why? That is so exciting. It's just so a way to curb noise pollution. Oh, and I am hoping yes. that other states take a cue from this. Other okay. states, people, take a cue. Okay. <laughs> so. Anyway, we're just talking today about social media and relationships. Babe. I know. That's a very powerhouse topic. I know. That's for those who don't online dating, we'll tackle it today. <laughs> Your relationship lasts. I know, Hello. right? I know we have a lot, <laughs> and we have a guest that's going to be talking to us about it. You never saw this coming. You never expected it. It's All right, great. so we're going to short break. I'm going to return. The bias segment kicks up now. This is the car. Oluwa Juwonlo, better known by his stage name J1, is a Nigerian singer, songwriter, performer, producer, and actor. He launched his record label named Next World Music in 2013 after his exit from Kenny's Music. J1 completed his primary education at ECWA Primary School, then went to fulfill his high school at Government Secondary School in Kogi State before graduating with HND honors in account from Federal Polytechnic, BIDA. J1 was honored with the Best New Artist Award at the Nigerian Music Video Awards in 2009. He also received Best Recording Award at the Hellis 2013 and the Tush Awards for this year's song. J1 has worked with notable artists such as Don Jazzy, Reminis, The Band, Tonto DK, Olamide, Dr. Sid, Davido, to mention a few. This is the car. When we tell you guys you never expected it, you thought you thought you were lying. I mean, same. <laughs> You're just talking about being right here. Yeah. I mean, you're right, when hands you, when down. You start, I can't even compete. Uh, oh anyway, my goodness. <laughs> it's not about that right now. We got the man with the hat. Okay. He's all right here, you okay, know. Okay, but okay, so yeah. somebody. Yeah, we'll do one love. Yo, hey, J1. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Great to car. have you here. We got a dad for J1 is around. No, no, Mel's yeah. right, guys. <laughs> Mel's right. Hey, hey, hey. Great to have you. Thank you. It's great to have you. But Mel was like, hey, what's up, everybody? It's all good. That's good. That's good. That's good. You're looking dapper and very fresh. Man. Really, this money, I don't even know how I'm looking. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> but, <laughs> no, but, no, but you know that the truth is, when like, some people are fresh, no matter what happens to them, they just always look fresh. So. Even when you tell really? them, even when you tell them, yes, so. like, really? Like, uh, you really like, think, uh, but they know that they are fresh. Even their spirits are fresh. Don't let it get to my head. <laughs> 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 how would like um, you like coming here today? Smooth ride? Right? Yes, I go no, back, I go back, I go back home like 4 a.m. and I woke up 7 a.m. Oh, wait, 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 you? Oh, Where were you last night? Last oh, night, I, I, I went out uh, like two meetings like, last night. And you know, this meeting. kind of meeting, where would they go? Mm. Mm. Like, you go there, you pay for joining. Yeah, and meeting. Like, and then you meet some people. Well, you know, you know so meeting, get different kinds yeah, of definitions. Yeah, meeting, you pay for joining. Do you know what I'm saying? I'm actually, I'm, actually, I'm, actually, I'm actually very, very happy that I made it down yeah, here. Yeah. You understand? Actually, sometimes, sometimes I don't. I, I, I like for like for like for like for like a year now. I've been running yeah, from early yeah. morning interviews. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, if you call me, was it like nine a.m. in the morning or, or, or eight a.m.? I just tell you no. No. But trust me, you know yeah. what? You have to make this one. You have to make this one because this is the number one album. Because you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys are special. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
<laughs> All right, so All right. before we even move on to um, what we're talking about today, which is mm -hmm. social media and relationships, mm -hmm. we're looking at um, the news stories making the headlines today. And then we got one from the Lagos State Government. Mm -hmm. They're going to ban um, live bands and all from performing. From the streets. Yes, so on from the, the streets. streets. Well, I'm yeah, when thinking, you're on the streets, yeah, I'm thinking really that it may not necessarily be right on the now. street, maybe major roads, um, maybe um, estates where people are. You know, sometimes we have places set up there. But what's your take as an artist? Mm -hmm. Do you think it's going to benefit live bands? and the likes some things are not just right so it's not about uh legal state saying uh, no you know this, this should be banned mm. you know the truth is this you can you we, 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 in, in nigeria i realize people don't they don't they don't respect other people's opinion okay you know because if you go on the street or you 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 you, you have a live ban mm. you know and let, let's say like an open hair yeah. live band mm -hmm. and you live in an environment where other people are people with families yeah. Yeah. you know and you make a lot of noise mm -hmm. you know same as churches yeah you know, it's not just church. about you know it's not just about the live band people mm -hmm. you know we don't respect other people's uh you know I you like know, that. Uh, noise pollution. Uh, you understand? I don't know what to put it like. Yeah. You know, I, I can't. I thought you was going to be biased. No, no, no. You don't have to be. It's, it's just, it's just, it's just the truth. Yeah. You know, all like um, people like us. Like, okay, you've been everywhere. You see how people do stuff outside the country, and when you come back here, and you I see do. the things that you don't, you don't, you don't feel you're already disturbing other people. Other people's own. Yeah. In, in as much as you know, we need to care about each other. Just you know, but I can't be saying because I care about you and I will be dying in silence mm. each time you, you know, make. Noise, noise, even when I, when I, when, so you are you know, about depressed, Nigeria. Yeah, that's you know, true. And you are able to make a lot of noise close to them. You know talking, what that can do to them. Talking about depression, though. Yeah. Today, we're talking about social media and relationships. Which has made some people very depressed. Trust me. Very, very. Trust me. So let me let me start with you now. Your personal experience. Start with, with him. Please be more well, in your sentences. I, I said it before. <laughs> now. I, I said it. I, I think I said it in an interview before. Yeah. Like, so people actually got me wrong. I said, most especially people on Twitter, a lot of them are depressed. And oh. it's, it's the truth. You don't understand because mm. how can people wake up one morning or one day yeah. and start fighting <laughs> over Ghana Janov is better than Nigerian <laughs> Janov? It doesn't. I, do, I can't. I can't connect to that. You know. No, Let me make sense. You don't understand. People trying to catch fun. These Fight people, the way these people, you know, they don't just, they don't just uh, say, you know, a lot of uh, bad things to themselves. Even they, they drag in. Families and all those yeah, into things the into the into whatever they they're, they're saying. And it doesn't. It, it, I just don't get it. Like when people go, on, you know, yeah. Twitter and you know, fight over things that are not necessary. Yeah, yeah. 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 Anyway, I don't think uh, I don't think he's the type to have um, because I've no, I've never really seen any um, sort of uh, relationship scandal. No, no, but we're, we're, we're going to be asking him. <laughs> you know, we're going to ask Definitely some that's questions. Why he's here. Yes, so yes, answer our questions live and direct. Hey. Uh, Jay, have you ever? Uh, what first of all, what do you think about the social media world right now? It's big. It's you know, it's big everywhere. Do you like it? I love it. I mean, yeah. I don't just like it. I love, I love, you know, the, the, the whole platform, the social media platform. Okay, you love, but you does know? the negative outweigh the positive? I know that there are many benefits of social media for different persons. Now, yeah, you for know. you, but, you see, as an individual. Everything that is good must have their own bad sides. Mm. Yes, but sometimes the bad outweighs the good. For you, does the yeah, bad outweigh the good, good or does the good, <laughs> or does the good outweigh the bad? The thing is, you just have to wait. Like, okay, yeah, what am I here for? Am I here for negative, uh, you know, people or am I here for, for 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 to to better my life or to I'm on Twitter, I'm on Instagram, not because of I wanna be there. Yeah. I'm there because of the fans. Yeah. You know, yeah. I need to update them on the on my project on the things I'm doing. So you, you know, I don't make music. You, you I don't find your reason. Yes, I don't make music for myself. I don't. Mm -hmm. Maybe you know, for, for I make. I don't. I, my mom's on that. Like, I'm not making music for you. <laughs> so don't be thinking like you know. You can just say yeah, you know. So in as much as in as much as okay, yeah. You know, I try as much as uh, possible to make reasonable music. Yeah. You know, but the music is not for my family. Mm -hmm. It's for the fans out there. Mm -hmm. You know, so I need to put them first because so at the end of the day, if you make music and I only have I mean, friends, but I don't you know you'll be broke. So you said I don't okay, care. You, you know? don't care what the family thinks about. Not that I don't care. My family is my family. Family comes yeah. first, you know. But, family comes but the thing is, when it comes to business, the family must not come first. Mm. Okay, so um, you got, you, 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 okay. let me just take it from the relationship angle right now. Okay. Now, relationships relationship. to you, are relationships supposed to be private? 
is it a private let's not even take it to marriage um, <coughs> already marriage is still going to come but relationship again a girl agree <laughs> okay, we, want to make, like we want to make this work we want to you know and all that she's such a private affair for me be made public and when i'm saying public i'm talking social, social media, media instagram twitter know, should it be made public because oh, yeah, again, let's bear it in mind that mm. relationships these days are <laughs> Relationships these days, Joe, listen to me. I'm, I'm really listening. Eh? Relationships these days are like the lady, the guy, and then the world. Yes. Is now, battle? what's your take on that? Should it, should a private um, affair like that be made public on social media? To be honest, though, I mean, like, listen, uh, I, I have um, been having a lot of problem with that, you know, because um, I don't do it. Mm -hmm. My relationship yeah. is not for the world. Why don't you do it? Because my relationship is my relationship. It's not supposed to but be sometimes don't, don't you get way over, um, over your head and you're like, oh, you just admire this person so much that you, you just can't, sh you can't not keep it to yourself. Then you be ready for whatever comes after. Maybe the, the consequence. Because people will bully, so will bully you. As, as, a, listen, as a public as a public figure, how do they say, you know, as somebody who's popular, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you, you know. you're prone to critics. Mm. You know, even when you are doing it right to some people, you are doing, you know, you're making them, you know, wrong. You're, you're doing, you're making one of the biggest mistakes of your life. Yeah. You know, so when it comes to a relationship, for me, no, if you uh, see, I've had a relationship before, I told her, see, if you anything you put out there, mm. eh, is at your own risk. At mm. your own risk. I don't, because <laughs> I don't, I, see, my relationship is my relationship. It's not for everybody to know. Because every, if you put it out, at the end of the day, when they start to believe you, when they start to say a lot of negative things about you, they're ready. Mm. Do you think you should care about what people are saying? Do you think you should care about what anybody feels? And then, feels or and then, then again, about? let me let me because just add something. At the end of the day, you're not living your life for them. You need to see. But wait, hold on. Please, let, let me just add something to that. She okay. said um, it should be private and and all that and all that. But yeah. I mean, girls love to. PDA. I mean, I was with my boyfriend. Forget the fact that let's even bring it down to normal human beings. Yeah. You know, yeah. PDA. You want to show people that you're lovey dovey with your boyfriend and the likes. Now, yeah. is there no way you can curb it? Not like you say her, you tell her not to post anything at all. There are better ways to do that. You just, you just. It's not. No, it's not yeah. about. See, listen. This thing has nothing to do with romance. Don't get it wrong. You're getting it wrong. Okay. If you're like like a normal guy now, okay, yeah, you're just a normal guy on the street, like okay, yeah, you just do your normal day to day job. You have, maybe you have like a five hundred followers or yeah, just two hundred followers. Yeah. We just go on a short break right okay. now. When we return, you see his conversation is getting heated up. Heated up. I'm fighting for the ladies. Yeah, we we'll go on a short break. We'll be right back after this one. This is the car. This is the car.